Treatments for breast cancer have come a long way in recent years. We now have many different and effective approaches to dealing with this disease. Hi, I'm Dr. Moma, a breast surgeon at St. Luke's Roosevelt Hospitals. One approach is surgery. There are two basic types. Total mastectomy is the removal of the entire breast with or without reconstruction. This used to be the mainstay in cancer treatment. However, we always strive to preserve the breast. So rather than a total mastectomy, we're often able to perform what is called a partial mastectomy or a lumpectomy. Between the two surgeries, the outcomes are the same given that the patient follows all the treatment recommendations. With the partial mastectomy, the surgery is usually followed by radiation treatment. Radiation is non-invasive. It's almost like getting an x-ray done. Typically, the treatment is every day for up to six weeks. Another form of treatment is chemotherapy. Here we are treating the whole body by giving medication through an IV. The last form of treatment is an anti homo medication. This involves taking a pill to prevent recurrence of the cancer. Of course, with all treatments, there are potential side effects, so you need to discuss those with your doctor. But I can state strongly enough that because of advances in technology and surgical techniques, breast cancer patients today are living longer than ever before. In fact, for some patients, life expectancy is up to 30 years after their diagnosis. At St. Luke's Roosevelt, we have a comprehensive breast cancer management team that works closely together. This includes breast surgeons, medical oncologists, radiation oncologists, plastic surgeons, and support staff. We focus on doing all we can to ensure that the patient is getting the best and most caring treatment possible.